within this critique, vote for Democrats because they decrease abortion, you'll hear something like this. You'll hear something like, well, you see, pro-lifer, Democrats address the underlying causes of why women choose abortion in the first place. So if you're really pro-life, wouldn't you want to address the status, the heart of the matter? Because if that's what's driving women to get abortion, well, let's go to the root. So that's what they say. Now, again, I'm not even sure that we can make that case, but that's what they're saying. But this is this is scandalous. We would never say this about any other issue because there are, there are underlying causes to all other types of certain behavior. But that doesn't mean it's misguided to pass laws against them, right? You know, we could say, well, the underlying cause of spousal abuse is is problems with men's psychology. So we need counseling for men. Well, shouldn't we make it illegal for men to beat their wives first? And then maybe deal with the underlying causes of what leads them to do that in the first place. It's scandalous, right? And by the way, uh, racist Democrats said similar things about the slave, about slavery. They said that, well, abolitionist states are actually having higher rates of racial bigotry, racial violence, because those pesky anti-slavery Republicans are trying to ban slavery. And so it's creating tension in states that are very used to owning human beings and treating them like cattle. So if you were really anti-slavery, you'd vote for the Democratic Party, which will decrease instances of racial bigotry and hate crimes, the abortion distortion. There is a moral atrophy happening in our moral reflex on abortion that is not happening on any other issue. So what does that really tell us? It tells us that some of these individuals who claim to be our allies, and certainly those who claim to be our opponents, don't actually believe the unborn child is a full human. So that's why we have to pass laws that function as a teacher while also engaging in the cultural wars to make our case in the public square, showing the humanity of the child, the inhumanity of abortion, and illustrating that any argument used to justify the taking of unborn human life cannot be confined to the womb. Those same justifications can be used to justify killing born people as well. Uh, uh, uh.